This is a memorandum to everybody in the industry who looks to stay up to date with everything, particularly with the ways things are happening and evolving when it comes to the artistic and creative matters. Things change and keeping an open mind is essential if you want to be a few steps ahead of the game. And then again, not everybody's trying to lead and be ahead. Some like to just be consumers, observers and critics of events, products, services. I understand it's always easier to judge and assess a ready product. The product that's been in the making for a long time, the product that took thousands of hours to put together, polish, refine, all those rapid iterations, multiple takes, numerous alterations. Creating and devising that product is a whole another ball game. I'm a musical creator and excellence is something I have been always aspiring towards. Letting shit slide and just getting down with the trends and tendencies is not for me. Not exciting. This whole thing about the job is like stopping the process of shaping and molding the goodness of the creative powers. I always say good is not good enough. Don't undersell it. I need to make greatness out of nothing, no matter what it takes. Even if it means it won't be accepted and liked. I'm so appreciative to the most high for the gift that allows me to trailblaze without looking for the approval nor acceptance. I wouldn't compromise the art for something that is fleeting and fickle. I'm also not super absorbed by what social media dictates. I believe artists should create with the right intent. The right energy equals fulfillment and self-realization. And good things like success and enrichment usually ensue. I believe in the right energy, no longevity in the material. The spiritual got the keys. Our job as creators is to explore that super side of the uncanny. We have to aim at the highest possible point that will evolve us past any snag and difficulty in the human experience. We need more intellectually challenging topics, discussions, debates, food for thought. Art should be eye-opening. I'm here not to be liked, but to educate and enlighten whoever is open to it. The greatest artists of all time, Shakespeare, Michelangelo, Rembrandt, no. Van Gogh, didn't ask anybody for permission to create. Greatness does not require anything but itself. You have to be misunderstood or what's better, you have to be not understood at all in order to make a dent, make a difference. Don't blend in, but don't be too different. It's also counterintuitive. Mm, I don't know how I feel about it. I think I'd rather be a contrarian unapologetically. I'm a hypercar. One more time. A mind-boggling mid-engine body V12. No, 200 kilowatt power pack. That's what I'm talking about. Max speed of over 350. Exemplary efficiency, the monocoque architecture, hybrid drive system, or better yeah. yet, all electric. Mm -hmm. You know, futuristic, minimalist, ultra innovative, crazy shit. Out of this world, one of a kind. A dope product of virtual engineering. I float on air, motherfucker. Not even a supercar, a hypercar, if you know the difference. That does not have good gas mileage. It's out of reach for most people. It's extremely expensive to maintain and ensure very high tech, very high performance. And you know what's funny? It will go over most people's heads. They just won't get it. They don't know how to operate it, how to put it to use, can't do anything with it. It takes the right person, the right kind of audience, eclectic, high-end. I'm the Tuatara, I'm the Valkyrie, I'm the SF90 with a thousand horses. You would probably do much better with a Corolla or Honda. An economy car, easy to understand, very reliable, very practical. What? What you want me to say? When you're used to what you're used to, you can't understand rocket science. Just relax, sit back and watch the greatness of all. Great shit is not for everybody. If you don't get it, it's not for you. The message was not meant for you. Move along. Keep on stepping. The memo is out. Go read it, go listen to it, and decide for yourself. One more time.